Hello everyone, it's Mallory here with All About Cats, and in this week's video, we're going to be taking a look at the Base Paws Dental Health Kit and report, and going over what happened when I used this kit with my cat, Wessie. So when I first adopted Wessie back in 2008, I didn't really have any awareness of the idea of feline dental hygiene at all. Um, I'd watched a lot of Expert Village videos in preparation for this. I'd read articles and books and tried to educate myself on cat care. And even doing all of that, I didn't really know that anyone was brushing their cat's teeth on a regular basis or that it was advised to bring your cat in for a regular cleaning each year. I think this was common for a lot of people around that time and earlier. Um, we didn't really think about uh, dental hygiene as part of caring for your cat. Of course, we've increasingly um, become aware of this as being something that's valuable, and that's a really good thing. Um, so by the time I became aware of dental hygiene as something of importance, Wessie had already developed bad breath, and uh, he was already starting to develop some tartar on his teeth. In part because Wessie, who is now 13, does have significant uh, tartar accumulation and definitely seems to have some signs of uh, gingivitis and gum disease, which I'll talk a bit more about later. Um, I'm very interested in anything we can do to learn more about our cat's dental health and to improve our cat's dental health um, over time. So the Base Paws Dental Health Kit and Report is a really interesting addition to the world of things we can do to keep our cat's teeth healthy and practice some preventative care. So what the Base Paws Dental Health Kit does is it allows you to learn about the microbes in your cat's mouth and how those microbes might translate to risk levels of three different conditions. So those are bad breath, tooth resorption, and periodontal disease. This is a new field of research and Base Paws is kind of on the cutting edge of it. You might remember that I reviewed the Base Paws uh, DNA test a few months ago. Uh, Base Paws it has developed this test that takes a saliva swab and then does a DNA sequencing to unlock things like proximity to different breeds, some traits, um, health markers, and now they're also looking at not just your cat's DNA, um, but the genetic material of organisms in their mouth. And so by doing this, they're able to generate this dental report. So essentially by looking at patterns of increased and decreased abundance of certain key microbes, they're able to kind of map out uh, your cat's likelihood of having different conditions. Then based on this testing, they're going to generate a report and send it back to you so you can get a feel for what's going on in your cat's mouth. So using the test is pretty simple. Um, if you have taken the base pods DNA test before, um, you'll be pretty used to the process. So you're going to want to pick a time when your cat has not eaten or had anything to drink recently, and then stick this little swab into their cheek pocket, try to hold it there for five seconds, and then put that swab into the stabilizing liquid in this tube. You're going to want to register your sample before you send it back to the lab, and then once you've done that, you'll send it off, and then eventually your report will come back in a few weeks, and you'll be able to take a look at what they've learned about your cat's oral health. So again, I used this test with my cat, Wessie. When the report came back, I found that he showed um, a high level of microbes that seem to be predictive of periodontal disease as well as halitosis and a low level of microbes predictive of tooth resorption. So just from my experience with Wessie looking at him and while smelling his breath, everything that I was seeing in this report was consistent with my experience, but it was kind of uh, difficult to interpret. I didn't exactly know what to make of it. Um, so I was able to have a call with their chief veterinary officer, Cash Karupu, and she went through the entire report with me our full conversation was a little bit long to include here, but I am going to put a link to the full 38 minute long video in the description and cards if you would like to check that out. In summary, she went through the entire report with me, explained all of the different segments, and gave me some insights into how Base Paws developed this test and report, and also how it's valuable. Dr. Karupu also suggested that I go talk with a local veterinarian. Unfortunately, I'd already made an appointment after I got the report, um, so I was able to have a local vet take a look at Wessie's mouth. 
She also had a look at the report and she said that everything on the report looked consistent with what she was seeing in his mouth, that there was definitely some uh, gingivitis and some tartar buildup. Um, Wessie was advised to go in for a cleaning sometime within the next six months or so. So that would be the next step in order to get some of that tartar off of his teeth. Um, but overall, he got a clean bill of health after that uh, exam, and it was good to get some confirmation that, indeed, the report did align with what we were seeing in his mouth. So while the vet I talked to locally um, seemed to find the report kind of interesting, I talked to some other LVTs who said that, well, it didn't really make sense. You could just take your cat in to see the vet for about the same price. But I think that the main place where this kit is going to have more value is for cats who are not already showing signs of dental disease. So there are cases where a cat may have some tooth resorption. It's not going to be visible in the mouth unless you have an x-ray. And so taking this test on a regular basis throughout your cat's life could help you to identify things that are not visible to the naked eye. It can also be helpful if you're doing the test multiple times. So say I get Wessie's teeth cleaned in the next few months, I take the report test again and I'm able to see if anything's changed. And so it can be a good way to track what's going on and kind of communicate with your vet using a little bit more data. So in that respect is interesting. But we have to remember also that um, while it does give us some good information and we're contributing to our general understanding of the oral microbiome, we still don't know what all of this means, right? And so it's not a diagnostic tool. And when you present this to your vet, even if you go through the base pause portal and submit it to them and they'll get all of this nice information from base pause, even so, this is all very new. They're not going to know specifically with each of these microbes means. Um, there are about 606 different microbes in at the average cat's mouth, and we don't know everything about each of them. Even if you're a veterinarian, you will likely be unfamiliar with these. With that being said, I do think that the Baseball's Dental Health Kit and Report is worth it. Um, it's a really interesting way to get some insights into your cat's uh, health, and it can also help to increase our general understanding as a community of how the microbiome affects um, dental and oral health. So again, you can either purchase this kit separately in the Base Paws store, or you can get it included in the whole Base Paws uh, breed and health kit. Currently, the dental kit is priced at $59, so $20 lower than the normal $79 price, and the full breed and health kit is going to cost $89, so $40 less than its normal $129 price. In addition to all of that, you're going to get six months of a free subscription to First Vet, so you'll be able to get telehealth services, and you'll also get a free toy. So it's a good time to buy the Base Paws Dental Health Kit or the full Breed and Health Kit um, that's going to be valid through December 24th, 2021. So remember, if you would like to get that discount, enter the coupon code DNA Gift at checkout. Um, I'll put all the details in the description. So other than that, I think that's about it for me today. Um, I hope that you found this video interesting or helpful. Um, let me know in the comments if you think that the Base Paws Dental Health Kit and Report is something you would find useful or something you'd want to share with someone else. What are your overall opinions of this product? Let me know about it in the comments. Thank you so much for watching. If you're interested in more product reviews, buyer's guides, and information on all things cats, please subscribe to the All About Cats channel and click that notification bell so you get the news every time we release a new video. Thanks again, and I will see you next week. Bye.